right, Charlemagne is not here, and you can give Donkey of the Day to whoever you want. I give Donkey to the Tooth Fairy. Now, over the That's weekend, you. You're the Tooth Fairy. Over the weekend, the Tooth Fairy did not come to my house. He was a little, or she was a little late. My daughter expected some money because her tooth fell out, and the Tooth Fairy was a little late. Give yourself Donkey Envy because you did not give your daughter now, her Tooth Fairy money. The Tooth Fairy fell asleep and forgot to put the money under the pillow. So we had to tell my daughter that she sleeps in a bunch of different beds. She sleeps with my uh, with my older daughter. She sleeps with my son sometimes. So we actually had to put the pillow, uh, the, the dollar under somebody else's pillow. But the donkey today goes to the tooth fairy. You should have woke your ass up. All right, Envy, yes. Please stop passing out like that. Hello, who's this? This is Deontay. Hey, Deontay. What's up, bro? Who you want to give donkey to, bro? I want to give it to myself. Uh-oh. Why? Are you the tooth fairy? <laughs> no, for that for that topic y'all just left off of, uh, I had slept with my homeboy girl a couple years ago. See? Why now why would you man. do such a thing? That was a plan from the get go. You're foul, <laughs> oh man. Oh my god. You know what? So y'all still friends? Oh, I'm sorry, I hung okay. up on them. I don't like dudes like that, man. Laura. Hello? Hello? Hey, what's your name, bro? What's good? This is Quinn. All right, man. Who you wanna give Donkey to, bro? Hey man, I wanna give Donkey to Justice Smollett again, man. Oh, again. He got it already. I, he got to get it again, man. Because the simple fact of the matter is, his his story comes out around the same time this guy is trying to kill prominent Democratic leaders. I'm like, you're deflecting. You're, you're taking the, the the news that people really need. Like, why is this guy allowed to say, hey, I want to kill all these people? And no, one, no news is talking about it. It's crazy to me. Okay. I don't understand it. All right, bro. I'm like, we got you. Donkey. Yeah, All right, bro. I'm... Laura. <laughs> Hi. Who you want to give Donkey to, Laura? I want to give Donkey of the day to my ex fiance. He got with the girl I accused him of cheating on me with, and guess what? He started a GoFundMe account to raise their new baby that they've had less than a year what? in their relationship. A mm-hmm. GoFundMe? Did you? You should contribute. You should give a dollar. <laughs> you should give one. That would be hilarious. You should dollar. contribute. Oh, I wasn't even, like, I didn't even know my friends felt the need to tell me. So I'm like, oh, okay, well, they started to go for me account because they lost their job. So I'm like, oh, okay. You should definitely Damn. give a dollar. See, that's crazy because back in the day, we couldn't start no GoFundMe to raise kids. That's crazy. That's I was like, like, go get a new job. What you mean? Like, what? You should definitely donate, like, 25 cents. Yeah, I would do a dollar. Just do a dollar and say good luck with everything. <laughs> right. All right. Thank you, Mama Malone. I'm, I'm glad she's not petty. Right. I would have. Malone. Good morning, Breakfast Club. Good morning, Malone. Who you want to give Donkey today to? I want to give Donkey today to a radio talk show host called Mark Stein. I wish Charlemagne was there so he, because this dude deserves his own Donkey today segment. What Tell us what happened. Yeah, what happened? You want Fox News? I think the name of the guy is Tucker Carson, whatever. Tucker Carlson. But he went on Mark. Yeah, he went on to say that black people should get over slavery and that we don't basically don't deserve reparations whoa you know he said he said slavery doesn't affect you know black people nowadays and you know we're successful and stuff like he said black people need to move on from slavery yes wow he He says he said slavery was abolished a century and a half ago nobody alive today had a grandparent who was a slave and in that sense i think you reach a point where you know you need to move on yeah he definitely deserves donkey today like, like, like we didn't have the 65 years of just and we're still and we're still living in the after effects of what slavery caused. So my goodness. Exactly. So I mean, like that's no, a great no donkey. African-American, no African American nowadays don't know their roots from Africa. Wow. You All can right. ask most African Americans today. So I think that dude deserves donkey. We Thank agree you, with you.